my life and my career, it has been dedicated to public service. Whether I was in office as Vice Mayor of Cincinnati or whether I was appointed by the governor and lieutenant governor to be over tourism for the entire state of Ohio, uh, whether I was going to run and win to be a state representative or go on to win and become uh, president of the Black Caucus or on the DNC platform committee and vice chair of the DNC convention, uh, or whether I had a chance to speak at the 50th anniversary of March on Washington, or whether now as I was able to win a very difficult race and become uh, a county commissioner, or whether it is uh, fighting for people as I do with the 513 relief bus, taking those resources to the people. The idea kept coming to me about this bus and one of the people who um, talked about this was uh, our uh, president, Joe Mallory. And we were talking about how to get the vaccine to more African Americans who were dying at larger numbers. And there was skepticism, but the NAACP, Joe Mallory and Brian Walker stood strong. And now we have the 513 relief bus. We have helped uh, uh, thousands of people. The Black Music Walk of Fame, I'm very excited about that. People will be able to come down and be able to really have our history of what we contributed from a musical standpoint to the country and to the world. Mayor Barry, who was a family friend, but also certainly a history maker. I uh, humbly accept this award, not just for myself, uh, but also for my father, uh, Dr. Stephen Reese. He was the young man that uh, Mayor Barry took in, gave him an opportunity, trained him, and gave him an opportunity to be the first African-American chief of staff. Almost a million plus people have voted for me over my career, and I uh, accept this on their behalf.